What do we have in this spot? Just a bunch of crushed tents. A torn picture. Maybe the Polynesian guy didn't like people taking pictures of his scar. Could be. The only tent that came out of the rock slide in one piece is the one filled with amulets. Hmm. Coincidence? Or do we have magic amulets? Ooh, yeah, that's... Wow, that was a giant thing. But we could probably push these buttons. Still no idea how we push those buttons. Our notes... I don't know. Because the murals seem to match. Like, hey, they match this, right? So this is... Let's go with that as our solution. So this is the one that's on the left hand side on the left hand side so on the left you'd say um that means we do the left of these ones maybe now that i'm thinking about it i'm probably giving a dumb solution but you know okay so left symbol so i'm doing the left symbol there let's see if i can find those other two well it looks like there's going to be a third one though we've got to find a third one Perhaps it's along this pathway. Uh huh. Are these figures singing like a choir? You've got to sing to open up the magic portal, obviously. These drops of rain are so refreshing. It feels really good. I'm glad you like it. All right, and looks like. This just matches up to the area that we were in earlier. Let's see, do I go really all the way this way? About Frank, Harry doesn't have many friends. When you finally do get to know him, he's so witty, so funny. They built a turbine to generate electricity under the falling water, but the stream isn't close enough to the wheel. That's a shame. Darn. I mean, clearly I've got a puzzle with it was power. A wound, but it kept getting worse. A Bible. It must have belonged to Frank. Hmm. Blood-soaked rags. Uh, poor Frank. Sounds like he did not meet a pleasant end. I mean, we know he died, but it sounded like he died in a particularly unpleasant way. Okay, can I mess with this thing in my bobber? Doesn't really look like I can. I mean, I could push this button that spins these things around. That appears to have zero effect on anything. These levers connect those gears to direct the wheel's energy into the turbine. Doesn't look like it can mess with any of those uh, levers. So let's see, the one in the middle is facing directly up. Let's try if the one in the middle is facing directly down. I mean, if the circle's facing directly down, does that affect anything? Vaguely. Yep, no clue how to solve that puzzle. Let's go back to the one that I was uh, already trying and failing at. Okay, does that sound good to everybody? So let's see, near Frank, I uh, turn here. Here we go. It's got to be the fourth one. Okay, so the one that's right, is, that's the one on the top. Does it look like it's got a different position? It looks like the symbol's got a different position each time, too. Anyway, so the one on the top. So this is the one on the top, so let's press the top button. This is the symbol that's on the right, so we're pressing the right button. Oh, and it's pretty easy to figure this out. It looks like they're all together in a big old circle. So that makes it easy. 
And this is the symbol on the bottom, so I press the bottom button. Did these stone columns just vibrate? Oh my gosh, did I just... Amazing. The hatches are opening. Did I just solve that puzzle on my own? What? No way. I did it. Wow. Okay, so that creates water. Um, probably increases the waterfall so we can solve that waterfall puzzle now. With the with the gears and the levers. Let's do it. Let's 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 do it. Now the wheel is moving. But I mean the one wheel is moving, not the others. Okay, so let's see. So it looks like they, they only move when they're at the bottom, so we'll get the one on this side at the bottom. And that moves that one over there. Brilliant. So that's into place. So we're going to press this button to get the, the middle one at the bottom. And we're going to pull the middle lever. And we'll do the same thing with the third one. So we press the button until the third one's at the bottom. I'll turn this on and power whatever it is. Huh, that was easy. What is it? What's These this? seem to adjust the amount of energy that goes through the turbine. Cool, what am I trying to do though? Am I trying to light them all up? Like that? that yeah. That should give the turbine some energy. Oh, wow, I'm a puzzle master today. Um, yeah, lights on. So, pull the switches. Great, I did it. Now everything should be powered. Excellent. So those music things should be powered, and I can just turn them on. Not the music things. Uh, this thing should be powered. I think this is the only thing we, we, we've we seen. Oh, wait. No, here's a switch. This looks like it's a switch. Good thing I noticed that blinky light. And we already saw this area, correct? We already saw this area. It's just that blinky light. That's the new thing. Okay. Let's climb up this. See if we can climb up the other one as well. Should be no reason for us to be unable to climb up it. Good, and this led to this thing. Well, what? Did I do something wrong? Come on, work. Come on. Yeah. Jeez. Nora, terrible idea. Terrible, terrible idea. Oh my. What the? Where am I? Now what? What's happening this time? Where am I? Is this another weird dream sequence? I think it might be. We're in an elephant's graveyard. I don't know about this. I can feel the fever rising. Oh god, no. My illness. Is it coming back? I did notice the the, the marks on her arm. Was they were spreading. An ocean. An ocean that dried up. I saw it when she was pressing those buttons. There's me and Harry. <gasps> No, I would rather die than use that damned thing again. Okay, your funeral, I suppose. Is that a giant whale? Yeah, it's like a whale graveyard. These really are ancient bones of a very ancient creature. Maybe it's a dinosaur. They are so dry. I need to find water. Uh. 
my are just bed. another memory of my illness. Or just keeps having these terrible oh flashbacks. I, think I was going to die lying in this bed. Gotta be a dream. This has to be some sort of dream. And going into the mouth of a creature. Can I go inside it? I want to go inside the mouth of the creature. I mean, it looks dangerous. Yeah, but I mean, you should be able to walk on this, right? Oh, it looks so warm and inviting. Well, I mean, not really, but it looks like I would have been able to walk into the creature's mouth. Like here, I can walk on these rocks. Why can't I ro walk on those other rocks? Oh, I guess I can only walk on these rocks a little bit. The horseshoe-shaped pillar and that diamond shape again. Yeah, I guess those are the symbols we've seen in the uh, island, yeah. Maybe she's just looking at those things on the island and having having crazy I lucid dreams. Noise. I feel woozy. What? Is that a house? Yeah, and it's floating in the middle of the sky. Is it? Are those That's fish? A house. That's our house in Inglewood. Am I dreaming? Those are fish. Or am I just losing my mind? Those are fish swimming around the house. Uh, Harry? Uh, are you home? Harry? Ah! -ha! I miss you so much, old pal. Aww, we made such a great couple when we weren't underwater and drowning. A picnic with Harry's brother and sisters. I started wearing gloves shortly after that day. Aww, what a fun family time. Aw, oh, man, my house is underwater. This, this is going to take forever to clean up. I'm going to need, like, five towels. I am definitely losing my mind. I don't understand what is happening, Harry. Are you... Are you alive? Are you dead? Are these floating books? Or... Uh-oh, where'd all the water go? Harry gave me this necklace after one of his scavenger hunts. Yeah, Harry does seem like the kind of guy who likes scavenger hunts and leaving behind scavenger hunt clues. It's a photo of my mother and me. She had just gotten worse from her illness. Oh, it's a beautiful picture. The happiest day of my life. Aww, that and is... one of the few pictures of Harry without his glasses. That is so weird. Yeah, yeah. I, I mean, that, that head thing is, is kind of weird, too. The Everhart Tucson. <laughs> what a duo. Mm-hmm. I remember my wife took off her glasses for the wedding, too, and then, like, <laughs> partway through the wedding reception, she's like, I can't handle this anymore, and put her glasses back on. <laughs> Checkmate in three moves. Wow, really? You could tell who's gonna win, but doesn't it make a different who's, difference whose turn it is next? I don't know, I don't know that much about chess. My mother's music box. Yet again. What, this thing? This this thing. Oh, that thing. Okay, okay, gotcha. Greetings from Cousin here. Robert? But I don't have any cousins. I don't have a cousin. Who wrote this? And does mom's music box have something to do with this? Oh, it's little mermaid. What a sweet melody. I mean, it's an okay melody if you like it. I can barely hear it. Okay, well after that weird dream sequence, we go back to where we were? Maybe? Yeah, back to where we were. She just fell off and uh, then she wakes up. What, what was that? Another vivid dream? And my music box again, but it wasn't broken anymore. And what a catchy tune. I wonder if that's the specific melody we're supposed to play on those loudspeakers to open up the doors. 